Hi, I'm Yarek Vilkiewicz, and today we'll talk about how to measure the additional engagement your mobile app is getting from Google Search. Let's say you run a coffee shop, like this one. People come and go, some just hang out and don't buy anything. Others spend a small fortune on coffee or tea and muffins every day. These are your best customers. When a patron buys something at the counter, instead of just hanging out, how can you tell where they came from so you can get more customers like that? Your coffee shop has two entrances. There's the office side entrance, where busy workers stream in to get their caffeine fix, and the street side entrance. Are the office workers more likely to buy something than folks who just walk in from the street? How could you tell? Suppose you could tag customers as they enter the store. You could then assign a different tag to the office and the street side entrance to see how the behavior changes depending on where the customer came from. OK, Google. Let's say that some of the customers find your store online, for example, by searching on Google. It would be nice if you could tell how much money these customers spend in the store, which items are their favorites, and even offer a special discount and personalized experience just for them. If you are watching this, you probably don't run a coffee shop. But if you've built an app, and if you integrate with Google Search for developers, for example, through app indexing, voice actions, or Google Now, Google Search will start sending referral traffic your way. Whenever Google Search invokes your app, in addition to the deep link into your app, a piece of data called the referrer is also included. The referrer is the string, and it looks like this. It helps you differentiate between direct traffic and referral traffic to your app coming from Google Search. Once the user enters your app, you can look at the value of the referrer string using the API to confirm the user was sent to your app by Google Search and then analyze their app activity or even build a complete conversion funnel using Google Analytics. If you are wondering how to integrate the deep link refer data coming from Google Search with Google Analytics, we've built a quick code lab for you to get started. In the code lab, you'll learn how to detect that the user entered your app through Google Search and how to record this information using Google Analytics. You will see how to build fancy graphs or slice and dice the data any way you please. Follow the link on the screen to get started. And thank you for watching.